We are here in Germany on a big lake and we are gonna film Das Battle of Das Hecht. Oh, yes, oh. man, nice. Sarah is hooked up. Team Sweden strikes back. Let's take it, take it, take it. There you go! Sarah, you go. Swedish Angers are the best. Yeah. Yeah. Guten morning, alles anglers, and welcome to another video. We are here in Germany on a big lake, and we are gonna film Das Battle of Das Hecht. Yes! Yay. Yay. We are here with our friends uh, Hecht und Barsch, Daniel Andriani. Yeah, really cool to be with you guys. Yeah, we have been at the Angelwald show in Berlin, so this is the Monday after the show. So we thought that while we're here, we need to do, do some fishing. When going fishing here in Germany, we heard that Peter is the guy to, to fish with. He's a fishing guide from uh, Pro Nature Guiding Service. So so we are super excited to see what this day has to offer. Yeah. yeah. So the teams are gonna be Daniel and Peter against Sarah, Toby, and me. Mm -hmm. and so I mean yeah. uh, three against two, but, but it's Sweden against Germany. Yeah. yeah. Sweden against Germany. Yeah. We know Germany is always a tiny bit stronger generally oh, than Sweden. Yeah. Yeah. So that's why we've got two against uh, three. Yeah. But Swedish angles are the best. That's so, true. That's exactly. true. <laughs> so we're gonna have a lot of fun. We, let we we can take that in consideration. If if we crush you completely, we will like have that in consideration. Okay. Yeah, thank yeah. you. That's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah. Kind of you but you have, you have the guide in your team, so, <laughs> right? so let's just get into the boat and get out on the lake and uh, let's do this. It's, yeah. We're going for big pelagic pike today, so we'll see if we catch anything, but we have the chance to catch some really big ones. Yeah. Yeah. So. Not many fish, but große hecht. Große oh, hecht. <laughs> so we're yeah, super excited, let's, let's do this. Let's crush these Germans. Yeah, Sweden for the win. Yes, slow fishing. Over the base outside. outside. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. We're going to have the best day ever. My gut feeling is good. So after talking to Peter, I th we heard that curly tails have been crushing it here lately. So I rigged this one up for Sarah, a flatnose dragon in real roach color. Wherever in the world you go, this color works magic. It imitates the roach or whatever perfectly. We have this very discreet turquoise touch on the back. What do you think, Sarah? Yeah, I think this. Perfect. Yeah, and this will do the trick today, for sure. And as always when competition fishing or when fishing, I mean, we want to complement each other as much as possible. So I'm doing this uh, shark shad, which has a different uh, movement. We have this paddle tail, yeah. we have one curly, one paddle. And Tobias, what are you gonna use? Lately, I've been having really good fishing on this lure, the Fat No Shad by Edwin Johansson. Sara and Pontus, they use the natural color, gray one, and I'm gonna use the, this color, the hot pike. So it's a little bit different. Super excited. It's a big, big, big lake. Can't see anything. Just that's me, that, like. just me. Yeah. All right, Team Sweden, let's do this. Let's crush these Germans. <laughs> Oh, are these fish? That's bream. Bream, yeah, nice. First weapon of choice, shark shad, halo shark, natural color, a little bit of glitter inside. So you can like cast out and let it sink for like five seconds yeah. or something okay. and then start retreating. So we're just drifting a big deep area now. We have a little bit of structure, like going up a little bit more shallow, but here we have around eight, 10 meters. We're drifting out against even deeper water, like 20. Fish! Ooh. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! Two casters, one caster. Oh my! It's a. Uh, is it a good one, Daniel? It's always a good one when it's for Team Germany. Scheiße! 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 Oh yeah, it's not so bad. That's a nice fish, man. Yes. Good job, Peter. Wow. <laughs> that's a nice fish. That's like. Wow, that's Peter. a big fish. Swallow that mirror's mouse. Oh. Yes, baby! Oh. Yes, man, nice! You're in the wrong team, but still. <laughs> <laughs> what a partner! Honestly, I haven't even picked up a rod yet. <laughs> Love it. Oh, that's a big fish. Yeah. We didn't even say yeah. what the rules are for the fish oh. for the no, competition. No. Usually, when we do these battles against other nations, we do the length of the three longest. Pike. Yeah. The length of the three longest? Yeah. Yeah. Three longest pike. Have we got okay. a tape measure on board? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey, we have a lot of more time. Yeah, yeah. Feel no pressure. And it feels like there's a lot of big fish here. <laughs> yeah, and I think, like we said, the conditions are absolutely perfect. Winter is around the corner. They need to start feeding. Yeah. So 
I think it's yeah. my partner. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, superstar. That's crazy. But you must keep on fishing. Yeah, Tobias, you film. I yeah. fish and Sarah fish. Yeah, yeah. we need to fish for Team Sweden. Yeah, when good for it. When is out of the water, Sweden strikes back. Okay, so this is the first fish I've ever seen on this lake. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, I've been here like ten, about five or six times on this lake. Always had bad luck. But now it seems like we're really on the right boat today. No, I've never been out with Peter. This seems to be the... It's, it's a fat one. Look at it. Thick as heck. Well done. Wow. What did you say, Daniel? Uh, amazing. That's just exactly what I expected from my partner. You know, us Germans are very efficient. <laughs> I think, I'm guessing it's going to be one meter and one centimeter. 98. Yeah. 98. Approved. <laughs> Yeah. Good work. Nice one. I good. love it. Yeah, good. <laughs> Daniel, I think we should have gone to a folder instead. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's good for Team Sweden, yeah, that's right? good for Team Sweden. <laughs> one has to say, you just saw we released the fish here. Some of you may know in Germany, it's, it's not always actually allowed, this whole catch and release. That is one of the reasons why these lakes here are also, in, in my opinion, so successful. The guys who run these lakes introduced a new rule a couple of years ago that any fish below 60 centimeters or above 90 centimeters can be released back into the water and um, it really seems to be making a difference here the fishing is um, very sustainable here on these lakes so maybe it's really something that the others can also think about in yeah. the future in sweden it's always catching release. in sweden it's totally normal i know and and that's why all the germans are going to sweden that's it that's why the germans go to sweden yeah. <laughs> but now i think it's time for me to start to fish again yeah i think that's yeah. not a bad idea yeah. Yeah. I think I'll carry on watching, it seems to be a good strategy. <laughs> Peter, you have a Swedish name, kind of. Don't you have Peter Berg? That's a, that's a Swedish name. Yeah, it's very common in Sweden. Yeah, Peter Berg. Yeah. He is German. Stop trying to think, <laughs> trying to take him over to the Swedish team now. <laughs> Maybe we can get half the points or something. I mean, that's a Swedish name, kind Maybe of. Maybe 50 centimeters can count on Team Sweden. <laughs> that's fair. Come on, guys. You're not yeah. very good, are you? No. The Swedish team here. Huh? What's going on? <laughs> when I watch your videos, I always see you catching big fish. <laughs> the power of editing. You edit them? Yeah. No. <laughs> Heavily. Do you really cut stuff out? <laughs> no, never cut something out, we just out. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh, Poisson! Poisson! Sarah! The freaking goddess! Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'll take the camera up. Yeah, yeah, we're teasing us. Like, yeah. what the fuck? Oh. Good, Sarah. Sarah is hooked up. Team Sweden strikes back. Yeah. Oh, just. I'm gonna let it. It's a good yeah, Take it, take it, take it. Yeah, it's a good there you go, yes. Sarah. You oh. go. <laughs> Swedish Sarah, team. You yes. to me. Pelagic oh fishing. Oh my god. Actually, I did not believe this. Oh my was god, it the I hard strike? Yeah, it was. Oh my god, I'm shaking. <laughs> nice oh, that's fish. a nice bite. On that real roach, Fatness Dragon, like I said. Yeah. I just started to tease Sarah a little bit. About the Swedes and fishing. About the Swedes yeah. and fishing and what's going on. I literally started like 10 seconds teasing them and suck. So <laughs> Sarah said, there you go, yeah. there's your answer. Oh my god. Show us what you get, Sarah. There you yes! go. That's this fat is a nice bike. On. It's a fat one. That's beauty. crazy. It's a beauty. On that real roach. Absolute beauty. Absolutely stunning oh, bike. Thank you so much for eating my lure. I'm freaking happy. It's all right. I yeah. think this might be even your personal best in weight. Probably it but is. We don't it's have, heavy. We don't no. have a scale, but. No, but it's a nice bike. There you go. Awesome. Yeah. Really fat. Yeah. Nice fat bike. Cool. Oh, I'm so happy. The wedding the board. 90. We'll give it a 91. 91. 91. 91. Bye.
Bye bye. Down into the depth, into the clear oh, water. Oh yes, yes. I'm so happy. Nice one. Yeah. Nice thanks, one. Thanks. I'm happy. Uh, I'm happy so for Team Sweden oh, as well. Oh yeah, thank of, you. Of thank course you we want. So much, of guys. course we want Team Sweden to catch some fish as well when we're on the boat here in Germany. Not bigger than us. Not bigger than Team Germany. No, but as long as they coming, catch. It's coming. It's <laughs> coming. That was a nice yeah, fish. It was thanks, really, guys. really fat. Well done. Thanks, guys. Cool. Toby, come here. Let's Sweden. Sweden, come, come, come. Yeah. Sweden celebration. Sweden. Yay. Yeah. Sweden. Oh. Yeah. I fished this pretty slow actually because I've heard that's what we're doing today so slow and then I took some pulses and maybe I don't know maybe two or three four meters down I'm not sure yeah. but make sure you always have the lure in the water that's yeah, the most important thing you just kept grinding yeah exactly that's the most important so thank you Flatnose Dragon I freaking love you and do you have anything you want to say to all the shops around uh, Germany and Europe? Yeah, actually if you want to support us, you can actually sell these slurs all over the world. So if you have a shop and you want to carry our slurs, you just send me an email and yeah, we would appreciate it so much to collaborate with some shops. Cool. And our shop Heston Bashti is already collaborating with them because we know what good lures they've got. Ah, so yeah. if you're looking for these lures in Germany, Heston Bashti, that's all I can recommend. Link in the description below. There it is. Get this exact lure. Yeah, so now we'll continue to fish. Yeah. Yeah. Fish on! Oh, it's not super big, but it's... Here we have the lead for Sweden! If I don't miss it... Ah, oh, smash the shark shot! Not super big, but... It's enough to bring us the lead! Yay! Oh man, really cool. Close to the boat here. We're over... How deep is it, Daniel? 13 meters. 13 meters. I tried this cast deliberately to like... Okay, now I'm not gonna let this lure sink too far. So I just cast it out, waited two seconds, and then started retrieving. So I think I was only like two meters down. Or something, and then boom! They're hunting now. They're feeding. Yeah. Go to Sweden. Yeah, Sweden in the lead. Let's see how long it is. Yeah, this is the smallest fish show today by far, but I'm still super happy. So now I better carry on fishing. I've noticed these Swedish guys are taking things quite seriously here. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have the lure. Search and destroy shark shad. That's exactly what we're doing here in over the deep water. We're searching and destroying, and catching beautiful pike like this. Who are we destroying? Germany! <laughs> We're destroying Germany with this, this color. Scheiße! Scheiße! Yeah. So, quick measure of this fish. 71, 2, 3, 4. 74 centimeters. So, 74 centimeters for Sweden. Super beautiful pike. Really, really strong. So, that's a lot of fun. Well done, Pontus Sjölund. Thank you. Way to go. Yeah. Way to go. Oh. Crap, I dropped it. Thank you, Peter, for bringing us here. It was a lot of fun. No Oh, yeah. Why did you drop it? Pontus? I don't know. It's too it? bad. 74. 74. So now we have 91 plus 74. That's 165 versus one. No, 97. 97 for Germany. That's a good pike, but you have to take a pike, and then it's even. That's that. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I plan on doing now. Oh, that's it. I did that on. Oh, big one, big one. Oh, I saw it on the road. Nice, this, this is a big one. Oh, my God. oh, what a take. What a take. On that gold digger dragon? Oh, 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 it's taking life. Oh, oh, it's a good one. What's happening, Tommy? Oh, oh. Swedish oh. anglers are the best. Oh. That's a really nice pike, Tommy. My first pike in Germany. Oh, Ooh, it's, a nice, it's one. nice one, it's a nice one. Can we take it? Yes. yes. yes that's a big pike, Tobe. Woo. Woo. Oh my God. That's not far from yes. 10 kilos, man. Oh, crazy. First, my first pike in Germany. That and it took on the pike, man. same lure yeah. as Sarah caught it you on. You changed to the Fettnos Dragon. Yeah. I think it's a meter. It's a yeah, nice me pike. Too. That's a really nice well, pike. It's 105, 110. It's really fat. 
really fat. Crazy. Top of my fing man. Whoa. Sweden. Oh. Yeah. Yes, man. It's a nice one. This thing is huge. Oh, let's take it up and take, have a closer look at it. Yeah, but it's crazy actually. Peter, yeah. you said in the, at the, in the morning that curly tails are crushing it. Yeah. Right now, they are working really good. Yeah. And you changed to this uh, Fatnos uh, Dragon. Yeah. And boom. Boom. There it goes. Thank you, Sarah. Oh, Sarah, Sarah, wait. Oh, like, thank yeah. you so much. It's heavy. And the thing is, it's really heavy. And the thing is, in Germany, they don't oh. weigh it. So it could be 10 kilo, but we can't weigh it. Yeah, I think this is like a high 9 or low 10 kilo pike, yeah, maybe. Because it's super heavy. Look at the belly here. That's a fat pike. Bream eater. That's why I changed to this gold exactly. brown. And it has the same color as the pike. Hey man. Awesome I'm so glad. Me. I'm glad to be here in uh, Germany fishing for this. I didn't expect this good pike fishing in Germany. I thought it was going to be really bad. Like only catching one. And that one would have been really small. But no. No. Oh, it's actually longer than I thought. 111. So, yeah. 111. That's a 10 kilo pike, Tobe. Yeah, I think so. With this length, it's a 10 kilo pike. Last look, and then back into the water. Toby, you're a fucking king. <laughs> <laughs> They're awesome, man. Yeah, let's put it back. Yeah. yeah. Swedish anglers are the best. Don't you never forget no, that. No, we never forget that. Okay, Team Sweden, group hug here. <laughs> come on. We're... Yeah, German can be here as well. Oh, so thank you. Peter, yeah. come on. Peter, come on. Yeah. Come on. We have one yeah. potential personal best and yeah. one group, potential 10 kilo pike. Group hug. And we are not even finished with the day. No, no, no we're like halfway. Ooh, yay. Yay. Thank you, Peter. Yeah. If you ever want to go fishing here in Germany, you should definitely come. Peter is your man, guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was really fun, actually, because Dennis, who runs this thing, he, when he saw that we were coming to Germany, yeah. he wrote to me like, oh, I saw you coming to, yeah. to Germany. You should go fishing with Peter. Yeah. And then that was like in the middle of the night, so I didn't have time to, to answer. No, I, I didn't exactly. even see it. And then in the morning after, you called Dennis and like, yeah, we're... Without knowing about it. Without yeah, knowing about it. Coincidentally, I called yeah. Dennis yeah. and thought, where can we go? There must be some place. And that's the only place I could think of where we might get some good fish yeah so like next time i, I check my phone dennis wrote like okay yeah daniel called now so <laughs> no need to <laughs> seems to have been a good plan yeah, yeah. thank yeah. god peter yeah. had time today yeah yeah, yeah. thank so, god yeah. i mean huge thanks to to you daniel and to you peter and yeah. to everyone involved because yeah. this is just awesome this wow. is a great we've day. got a guy yeah. who knows yeah. how to catch yeah. big fish one yeah, but to say first, first blood in germany yeah first blood in germany <laughs> <laughs> so show us your lure yeah. the fun thing here is that sarah oh. caught a fish on the on the real roach Flatnose Dragon, and then you asked if I had a uh, Flatnose Dragon in my box, yeah. and this one was crushing it on Åland like one week ago when me and Mille did a paddle versus curly tail challenge. You can watch it up here if it's published when we publish this one, otherwise I'll leave the link in the description as soon as it's uh, online. But we did paddle tails versus curly tail challenge, and uh, yeah, these guys crushed it. And here there's a lot of bream, uh, the guide said, uh, so I put on a brown one. And it works. Yeah. And it's uh, quite cold in the water now, and that's why this paddle uh, or why this curly tail works so good because you can fish this lure really slow, and then the pike will go up and grab it. Yeah. No, no I love no, this no. lure. No. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it pointed. Okay. Uh, okay. For that <laughs> fish, you will get to keep it. <laughs> Thanks. Crap. Can I, can I have a new one, Sarah, from the, from the yeah, warehouse? Yeah. Let's see about that. Okay. <laughs> let's see how you're fishing today. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> congrats, man. Yeah. Thank yeah, you. Super, super cool. And that big pike was caught on a river beast from Abu Garcia with this Saxa Shade Generation 2 rod. And I like this rod very much because it's up to 170 grams. So you can cast the lure quite a big distance. And that's uh, very important when fishing this pelagic to really cast far away. And then you need a little bit longer rod. This one is uh, eight foot four. So it works perfect when fishing pelagic like uh, this. 
So here we have a lure that you might have seen in one of our earlier videos. Uh, earlier this fall we did a 120 euro handmade swim bait versus a 2 euro soft bait challenge. And we said in that video that when it gets 5000 likes we're gonna give away this lure to one of you. We released that video yesterday when, when we do this fishing so that hasn't happened yet. So I'm gonna give you this a last go before having to give it away. If you lose it now, then you need to jump in and pick it up yourself, mm, yeah. okay? Yeah, then we need Promise. to d delete that other video. Yeah, exactly. Something. And since we have uh, lots of bream in this area, Peter told us, I think this one can be smoking oh, yeah. hot. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. That could be good. So we'll see. Yeah. I, I better use the time when I still have this one. Super nice lure. Handmade in uh, the Netherlands by Lucky Lures. Come on, Daniel. Everyone is waiting for you to catch a fish. <laughs> are, you, no, are you kidding me? I swear to God, it was a bite. <laughs> oh. We were just talking about, you know, that Peter caught the first one, then Sarah, then Toby, then me, or yeah, that way. But we are now waiting for Daniel to catch one. <laughs> are you kidding me? Are you serious? As you turned in my direction, boom, bite. Everybody gets a bite. The fish stays on the hook. Daniel gets a bite. The fish comes off the hook. That was, that was... Pontus just turned around and said, come on, everyone's waiting for you to catch a fish that we can start catching again. Exactly in that moment, I got a bite. <laughs> was a nice bite also, it was a nice fish. Scheiße! This little beauty here, man. Eh? These two lures that have been working good today, the Mira's Mouse and the Flatnose Dragon, they have actually two things in common. First is this curly, like strange curly tail uh, version thing. But it's also a uh, cross design between Swedish and Italian lures, because uh, this one is an Italian design, but it's brought to us by Catch With Care. So it's a Swedish company, so Swedish slash Italian. And this is also designed by Edwin Johansson, the original Flatnose. And we've combined it with uh, Paolo Pacerini is a flat nose dragon tail who is an Italian fly tire. So Swedish slash Italian lures are the best today. <laughs> Man, I hope I get another bite. I hope that wasn't, you know, this kind of fishing is the kind of fishing where you don't get like millions of bites, you know. You kind of need to catch the fish when you get a bite. But there's a couple of hours left. <laughs> Oh, 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 big one! There you go, there you go, big one! Big one! Big one! Oh, it's oh. another! Oh, oh, it's another big one! That's a bike! But Almost, not really! Yeah. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> Thank you! What a take! That was a hard take! On that dragon again! <laughs> Good job, yeah. yeah! Yes! And there we are above 3 Whoa. meters, I think! Whoa. I fly, Too man! High. Good Toby. This guy's a performer. Petri. 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 Toby, my yeah, man. I'm crushing it today. Yeah. Crazy. Not you, but the lure. The, the yeah, dragon. the lure. <laughs> Not you. Not you. <laughs> Crazy. Swedish Italian lures are the best. That's For all, sure. And that fact. And that hard, that strike was insane. It was super hard. Yeah. Oh, big. Oh, oh, big one. And now we maybe have three meters when I'm the three longest fish. Yeah. Team Sweden. That is good. Yeah. That is good result for sure. I'm so proud to be in this team. <laughs> <laughs> I picked the wrong team today. You did. I think it's Peter been... picked the wrong team today. <laughs> yeah. It's been super slow for, uh, I think it's been a few hours yeah. since we last yeah. caught a fish and then Daniel lost his only chance. And, yeah. But now, all of a sudden, boom. We just kept casting, kept grinding. Thanks for the new hope. To be us, really asking. just one has to say, I mean, Tobias just kept casting, he yeah, kept casting, always. kept casting. Yeah. Some of us were taking it a little bit easy, relaxing on the boat. Well, talk for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> well, Pontus and me was casting. We are been casting yeah. all the time. Yeah. On the flat nose dragon in the color gold digger. Here we have it. There we go, another super beautiful pike. Yeah, it's not as fat as the other one, but it's actually quite long. Oh yeah. So, Look yeah. Another that. nice fish, man. Yeah, I think it could be a meter pike. Yeah, Probably. let's find out. That yeah. could be a meter Just shy, I think. 98. 90, yeah, I also think. Like let's check. End of the yeah. 90s. But let's check it. Uh, maybe it's a meter. Do you hold the head, yeah, Sora? Yeah, yeah. It's what, did I, what did I say? 98. 98? Yeah, 98. Okay, Ponte. Yeah, I think we have 299 <laughs> centimeters. Seven. No, we have exactly no. 300. No. 99. No, not 91. 91. Yeah. 111 and uh, 98. <laughs> 
<laughs> so it's like the three meters. Three meters um, of pike on the three longest pike for Team Sweden! Ooh. Not even surprised. My man. Such a beautiful fish. Look at that pike. Okay, okay. group hog, Swedish hug. style. Yo. Oh! <laughs> Team Sweden! Yeah. Swedish yeah. angles are the best! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How does it feel? Swedish anglers. Swedish anglers really are the best today, we have to say. Um, Especially if Toby is in the Swedish team, it really helps. <laughs> uh, well, what do you mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> you are so good, Pontus. You are so good. Thank you. <laughs> so now, as you can see, see, the light is coming down, and we have one more hour to fish. So we just need to keep this lead now, Sweden. We're doing good. What's the tactic for the German team? Daniel? The tactic was the whole time we were looking at this thing like a marathon, and you really not, you really need to know when to start sprinting, and. <laughs> We've kind of hit the moment when you start when you need to start sprinting. That was around 11 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> it's it was a really long marathon, and now we're now we're about to hit our sprint. We're gonna we're gonna do a sprint for like the last 40 minutes and pew, sprint past the Swedes, hopefully. Ah, <coughs> uh, Peter, you ready to start sprinting? Yeah. <laughs> I, I think we have this. It's done. We can stop sprinting now. Sarah's pretty confident. <laughs> You're not nervous know. about our sprint? No. No? no. <laughs> we would no. love to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're watching carefully now, so make your best. All right, Alice, it's a wrap. Ah, yeah. It's ah. a wrap. That's it. It's been a ride, but uh, Sweden came out on top. Swedish anglers are the best. Swedish anglers are the best. It's scientifically proven. Yeah. <laughs> it was Even very, very close. It was a tough battle. It was yeah. really close. Uh, yeah. we, our tactics, we just started the sprint a little bit too late. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, ended up not catching the last two fish that we needed. Yeah. Guys, well done. Swedish anglers really are the best today. Yeah. You Thanks. proved it today. Yeah. Good Thank battle. You. It was really a lot of fun on the water. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. You saw yeah. some really nice fat German fish. Yeah. Yeah, it was cool. But and thank you, Peter, for having us. It was yeah, our pleasure. I really yeah. called no the dream problem. fish. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that was no problem. crazy epic. If you want to go fishing here in Germany, we highly recommend it. I mean, yeah. for sure. Yeah, it's crazy. Hopefully we'll and come back here someday. Yeah, we, we need to come back here someday. It will yeah. be really fun. Like we said in the beginning of the video, we have been three anglers against two anglers, which is not really fair. So we will take this in consideration. But no matter if we take me away, or Toby away, or Sarah away, Sweden are still the winners of this competition. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. And we'd like to we'd like to kind of like give you a prize and not only you, we'd like to give also all of the viewers a prize. We're gonna give everybody who uses the code, the um, discount code, Swedish Anglers are the best. It says it down in the description, just have a look. Um, you can get 10% on all of the different baits from Canal Gratis. You can see they really do seem to work. Um, so yeah, come and buy it in our shop, heshtonbarsch.te. You can see everything written up here or written down there. Have a look. Uh, thank yeah. you so much for your support. Yeah. It means the world. Yeah, Heshtonbarsch is one of the sh awesome shops that are supporting what we are doing on, on the channel. So huge thanks. This yeah. is, we, this and I can promise we do also have videos where also the Germans catch fish. So if yeah. any of you feel like <laughs> having a look at our YouTube channel, we'd be happy to see you guys. And I'll be happy to see you guys also at the fair in Sweden, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah, Sport Vision Fair Sweden. I'm really looking forward to coming and seeing you guys there. There we will also show some of your crazy lures, the drunk bait and the coffee yeah. and... Yeah. Finesse filet, yeah. Finesse filet. Sure. These guys have some well. super crazy lures also yeah. that we are looking forward to, to try in Sweden. Uh, maybe this spring or something. That's it, together. we're gonna go fishing together in Sweden. Looking forward to it. Exactly. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, but uh, I think that was it for now. Yeah, we need to go back to Sweden tomorrow morning. So now it's back to the Airbnb and pack everything It's together. about time you guys go as well. I mean, I'd like to catch some fish. If I feel really <laughs> done every time I go fishing with this guy over here, it's like, Jesus, I mean, there's a lot to learn. Yeah. Guys, we see you soon. Yeah. Ciao. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> Ciao.